There's a variety of different deductions, reliefs and allowances available that can help you reduce how much tax you pay. But let's start by looking at those which apply specifically to businesses. Sunita Shroff has been talking to a partnership in London about some of them. Sanko supply a large range of their school uniforms to retailers all over their region. Everything a student might need, including sports and casual wear. Not only this, they also sell direct to the public here from their shop in Hounslow. Like all businesses, Sanko can include in their accounts two different kinds of expenditure, capital and revenue, which can help reduce how much tax they pay. I asked one of the partners, Sandeep Sud, to explain the difference between the two. Capital expenditure refers to all the assets we buy for the business, things like tools, fixtures and fittings, computers, that kind of thing. And all of these expenditures are normally eligible for capital allowances. And then there's revenue expenditure, and these aren't one-off expenditures, things that are involved in the day-to-day -day running of the business, like rent, rates, wages, salaries, the cost of your stock, that kind of thing. And it's really important to get the distinction right between these, as different allowances or reliefs apply accordingly. It's also important to distinguish any private expenditure you've made through the business too, as you can't get tax relief for this. For example, things like personal clothes or personal goods are all non-allowable. And if you buy something that's primarily for your business, but you also use it personally, you won't be able to claim for all of it. I bought a car on the business, which is a capital expense, but because I use it privately as well, I can only claim a proportion of the cost of the vehicle as a tax relief against my annual profits. The same goes for petrol as well, some of which is allowed as a business expense and some of it is not. It all really depends on the ratio of business to private mileage that you do. If you're setting up a new business, there are also various other allowances which you can claim for in your first year of trading. This is Sunita Shroff reporting from Hounslow.